Hello, it's me, Jackalopian. Welcome along. We are back playing some more of the Leviathan's Fantasy. This will be episode 16. Let's uh, crack on with this. We are back on... We're back on um, the new DLC, Mechanical Crisis. We did fly off. We... We looked at it when it first came out uh, and then we kind of like flew away because it was like, it wasn't, it, it, I mean, it looks beautiful and it's really nicely, uh, it looks great and there's a bunch of good stuff happening and, you know, it's fun, it's good times, but it was um, quite Badly optimized. Um, the kind of translation was terrible. Um, it launched with a new, or it launched with an old, I should say. <laughs> um, it launched with an old bug where um, it just didn't. You couldn't. You couldn't leave once you got here. But that all got patched out fairly quickly. However, what? Um, what? didn't get patched kind of overnight day one can you still call like DLC day one patches because obviously the DLC not newly released games uh, so yeah looks like um, this guy's being beaten up here what we are going to do however is we're going to I'm going to send a second team over. Ah, I wanted to... Right, there we go. Uh, I have also... Yeah, I mean, basically everything's been been patched so that it all works now so you can actually leave if you want you just have to go through um the same way you'd leave any island you just have to complete like 80 percent of the uh, tasks the quest i guess they are not just quests are they because quest completed is category one that's the top category. So yeah, just um, it's the same as before. You have to complete 80% of these um, tasks and then you can just fly away. So that's all good. And um, what is difficult is the translations and they are still being translated. They What is happening is because they're an indie development studio, they kind of rely on the community to translate all of this stuff and i think that's kind of cool um so yeah obviously you know it's unpaid people like just playing through it and you know translating it themselves so that's pretty good um mostly we can get through uh, and most of it is done but <laughs> i remember asking about one of the older tasks, one of the tasks I've already completed. And it was like translated at around about the exact same time as I I was querying it. <laughs> so people were like. I kind of, well, a, I mean, this should, I'm guessing this could be. One of the last quests over here, it's... Uh, Mechanical Dinosaur C. And is that Mechanical... Mechanical Dragon A, I think? Or Mechanical Whale A, maybe? Um, we are still a tiny bit weak. We're not strong enough for this stuff, but we're 
very close and you know we're pretty much at the deepest we can get um, so I don't know if anyone remembers but the first time we came here we were kind of like we couldn't even fight any of these creatures when we were here before we had to kind of like stick to a roundabout I think it was the second the second lighthouse so first lighthouse second lighthouse and we won't go and be on the first, the second lighthouse but as you can see we're all the way at the kind of towards the ends of the islands now I mean we're still not we're still not getting through it particularly quickly I kind of wish you could put in uh, bookmarks. That would be cool. So you could like teleport around or teleport the camera around a bit easier. That would be cool. Uh, but obviously that's kind of stylistic. It does look beautiful though. I mean, I had, you know, there was no qualms about how, how good it looked from the start. And like I've said before, I've turned down the graphics settings and it still looks beautiful. I love the look of the new mechanical creatures. I think they're amazing. I even posted up some old photos of Zoidzilla, <laughs> if anyone remembers that toy. Or if anyone's seen that toy, I used to have a Zoids in it. I, I was massive into like Zoids when I was a little kid. Um, and they were like, oh, Zoids, you know, from like the early 80s. Yeah, so um, I have actually gone through and made all of our, well, I say all, I've not done all of them. <laughs> team with Zeus and Hongmei and Sun Wukong. Where are they at? They shouldn't be over here. I don't think they're over here. Um, I have hired on a bunch of new guys as well. Is there anyone hanging around that we can hire? No. Um, I do want to hire a bunch of the uh, kind of like fully like armoured bodied, armoured head, fully armour plated knights. I think there are like three or maybe even four variations. I don't know if I'll hire all four of them. I've also... What else? I've also managed to promote. Sun Wukong. It was always going to be Sun Wukong. There he is. Look at that background. That's awesome. How have we done that? What is that? Why has he got such a weird background? It doesn't follow through. That's terrible. And uh, these are the, uh, you know, like Beast Wrath and Dragon Breath. Those are the new manuals from the new DLC. Uh, and the other thing that's happened with Sun Wukong. 
I've actually promoted him. He was my first promotion. Look. Where's the promotion? I've also... I've also recombobulated the town. I've also rearranged all the buildings. So the adventure dorms are over here. The village dorms are over here. And we've got a bunch of workshops. Just so I can work through all of the kind of workshop uh, production queues. Just like in a one -er. There are, you know, like um, crafting tables, kitchen, crafting, and then our shops are all arranged like so, just so you can go in, you can just go in, like in a one and just go around all of your shops. I've run out of beds. <laughs> so the uh, Mystic Realm teleporter is right next to the island teleporter. Just got one armor shop now. Trying to um, everybody with tier 3 armor and tier 4 or higher weaponry uh, and then yeah there's the promotion line. look there's no there's no Sun Wukong because I've already promoted him so everything's just we need to just gather up all of these Sources for promotion uh, and yeah I have gone through every character now and just gonna get on to speed one real quick uh, so everybody I've literally gone through I keep saying everybody He's actually, like, eaten up all of his gifts. So he could probably do with more gifts. Uh, and like I say, I have actually got a bunch of new guys. Where do they start? Orthos, when we yeah, I think we've seen all of these guys before. Um, I <laughs> had a bunch of these green guys as well. Uh, I'm gonna just start to. I haven't done it yet, but I'm gonna just start developing a bunch of green guys. I'm hoping that his personality is good. Lame. Well, okay, that's bad. But it kind of like, actually that's thematic, because he's like a big... <laughs> he's got a 1% magic attack. So not everyone has got like a tier 3... Yeah, so I guess those are going to need to be maybe manually uh, But yeah, these are She's just been reborn uh, So yeah, a bunch of green guys and there's also I managed to find Because I went to the old the old new DLC which is the the, the hidden sect the legendary sect DLC and then a bunch of like wandering dudes also became available so I 
So I pulled the trigger on and hired all of them as well. So Meng Chi, Floating Cloud, Lance. Uh, Tian Yu, Yaki, Yaki. Yang Shi is another green guy. Look. Uh, but yeah, you can just change their bloodlines. You just like assign them the same old like purple bloodlines. Um, so that's the next kind of project. I haven't, I haven't gifted any of these guys. They don't even have decent mounts. They've all got like old green mounts. So that's something else that needs to happen as well. We need to sort out their mounts. I've kind of like been slowly working through that. And I have been trying to like equip everyone with like tier 3 gear. And that's the end of it. Uh, I might get Crow as well. Just because I think he's a unique portrait as well. I've been trying to hire on people with like unique portraits. Uh, and actually getting rid of people who don't really have unique portraits. Uh, so yeah, Leo might look kind of similar to a guy called Morpheus who's on some of the older videos. So they're reusing the same portrait. So I hired on Leo <laughs> just because he's a purple guy. And then I got rid of Morpheus just because they share the same portrait. This is like a little bit of a joke and um, there are kind of like recurring portraits uh, and Zhu Chu is one of the guys with a recurring portrait. Maxwell is like and Mike are very much recurring portraits. If we scroll through slowly that's the same portrait. <clears throat> Albert is the same as Mike from earlier. And Yu Feng. Uh, look, those two girls. And there's the same portrait again. The same portrait again. The same portrait again. There's Morpheus. <laughs> I uh, see so attacking yeah, and packing, parking and talking. Uh, and there he is again. Look, Lucian. <laughs> uh, but you want, just because that's a joke, because that character model turns up a lot. Look, you can see there's two straight away. Uh, and there's the Lushan model. There he is. Huh? Just because there are like similar models, there are like that just turn up over and over again. Look, there he is. There he is. But he's neither of those two. He's like a third guy called Taurus. I mean, all Taurus are called Taurus. Um, I guess so as not to kind of like overload. <laughs> okay, there's nobody spinning around in there. Look at them. Um, I do think, I do like uh, just hanging out here. I do think it's uh, quite good fun. Uh, it's like kind of wondrous. I do quite like the kind of cute wondrousness of it all. Let's assign some extra drinks. Oh, we've only got a couple. 
Uh, but yeah, we would need to go in and... Oh yeah, there was permanent... Uh, so I finally got around to sorting out my like permanent building queues, like workshop queues. Finally, I should have taken care of this like fairly near the beginning. I was just kind of like half ass in it all. Uh, blessing level fourteen and fifteen. Ain't great, but it's not too bad because on the island, the way I oh no, okay, our I've got like a, a permanent a loot farm sort of here. It's not really a farm. I do want there. We'll set down. Looks like that guy at the bottom could probably do with being uh, reincarnated. Shall we reincarnate him while we remember? Ivy Fifeng, Carl, and yeah, there's the guy there. I don't know what that name is about mo wu kill what what does that mean <laughs> but that's his name mo wu kills sort of like django kills maybe i don't know <laughs> Uh, and then, yeah, I uh, have been trying to breed a bunch of mounts. Nice. Very cool. Nice gold mount. Sunry. Anybody else we can send? Yes, <laughs> all, of that. all of those, and I can't, there is no kind of breeding stock whatsoever. That's ridiculous. Let's try and breed those two together. And we add one gold, right? So, actually, that might even be two golds, is that? Uh, and then, yeah, the uh, kind of like blue bloodlines. We're going to get changed to the epic bloodlines eventually as well. Ugh. So there's still tons to do with in strengthening the heroes, but I have been through... and sorted out a bunch of these guys. One of these, we've got gold horses, she doesn't, so she could do with a new mount, Tiffany, uh, and then yeah, we got to work through all of these, uh, and then I worked out before, didn't I, was it during the week, during last week, where it was like 6 million, so we've only got like, you know, 10 quarters before like, we're out of money. So 
Let's give her the new tunnery. So actually did, okay, we do have the old tunnery as well. Okay, great. And then I'll just give it to this girl here as well, Lotus Bud. Doink. Let's give this guy Epic Mount, that's the Doomsday Whistle. Yeah, but there are loads of kind of blue mounts. Um, it's just because I hired on so many people. I had like a mass recruit in. Drive, which is why everyone's got like terrible mounts and terrible weapons and terrible everything but yeah trying to like assign everyone tier 3 armor yeah let's just do it next episode i'll sign off now and then we can like do all of that in the next episode so yeah thanks for watching please do leave a like comment and subscribe if you want to see some more and um, the leviathan's uh, fantasy. I don't think we're that far away from ending this now. I mean, there is a ton of end game stuff we we need to concentrate on, which again we'll look at next episode. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Bye for now. George with her. Your mother's a bitch.